my merch is still there. If you forgot that I have an art shop, I've added hoodies and I'll be adding more designs in the future. I'm thinking of I'll do it tomorrow kind of shirts, but I'll do that when sales are going well. Now into the video, you'll know how much I change my style, and how many styles I have, and will have, and I'm still adding more, and more cause I love trying everything, yes, and this was kinda not going good, when I try making comics, webtoons, or mangas, or even animations, this is why I made this video, to talk about it, and to show you my dramatic thoughts, how I suddenly lack of inspiration and motivation, and why I hated what I do right now. First of all, the webtoon I've made back in 2018, Sofra Sign. It was a silent fanfic. It was based on parallel universes and like. There were four universes with the members divided on it, and Jin was more like the god of time. Jin was alone, and he wanted many things just like the members. He had mixed feelings while watching the members through all those different universes. He wanted to have what they had, but also wanted to protect them from all the troubles they are going through. Jin's mixed feelings started being louder and louder and shit until everything got messed up and now more scary universes and creations are all mixing together and creating a whole trauma to the other members. Jin would realize how that destroyed some members lives, so he would travel from one universe to another to fix everything. And yes this silly story is all by me, and it's related to BTS storyline, especially from Rub, Wings and Highlight Reel stuff. Anyways, why I stopped it then. Yep first of all, I didn't feel like it, second of all, it's a fanfic, I don't want big hit, to sue me for using BTS as characters, I didn't actually know that by that time, third, my freaking art style changes from every panel so what do you expect for me to do, also it was boring as hell to keep drawing the same project your whole life, especially that my story was kinda long, I guess 100 chapters would at least, show the whole story, or 50 if every chapter was so long. Then the webtoon Save Me came out after few months, and I was like, and I, oh. it was very similar to my story in few scenes, and I was kinda jealous not gonna lie. Now passing to animatics, I actually have more animatics that are still storyboard like 80s. I have 4 unfinished ones that I won't finish probably, even though almost all of my ideas get drawn by other artists, so I just give up and accept my unmotivated ass. Yes I really seem like that person who is always motivated on social medias, but in reality I'm a whole overthinker and I give up really fast, and I just let things and works and projects down. Well one other thing, before I show the animations even though I know many people skipped to them, and didn't see the whole thing, I'm really fed up with drawing things, that I'm unmotivated to draw now. For example, BTS. Yes I was obsessed, and I still love to draw them, but people cause of my BTS fanats never knew about my non-K-pop art, so my whole art account seemed like a Korean pop fanats only. People always ask me, you don't even draw one single thing beside them. Bro I draw anime and other art and original art a lot. People just sleep on it, and focus on BTS. People actually came for BTS, and not my art. This is why sometimes I get so unmotivated, and I think about my art being just trash, and not impressive a lot, when I draw something original. So it makes me stop many things, that I actually love. But yeah don't mind my dramatic ass, someday you will love my art as it is, without it being related to BTS. Anyways here are the unfinished animations.
I've posted the teaser of this, but never finished it, I'm so sorry for that. I had many studies and final projects, and most importantly I lost motivation all of a sudden. I actually was so excited for this, and I skipped many classes to do it, and finish it fast and post it, but then I rush it, and it looks ugly all of a sudden on my eyes, and most importantly, my style changed a lot, and it made me so uncomfortable with how the video is. The ideas of the video was also kinda mysterious, somnambulist actually means sleepwalking. Yes EQ you need to learn the basic English first, because you suck at it, and you look stupid with your grammar mistakes and weird wording. The killing point was going to be at the end. J-Hope was the main character, and he is the sleepwalking. The last part that I didn't finish was Yungi's part. This animation was just stupid, and I just didn't want to finish it. Passing to the next unfinished animatic. This was going to be about Vimana's kids, and it was going to be related to quarantine, and how our feelings are all mixed and how a person would help you get out of those feelings and bright up your life. Why I stopped it, it was a very short animatic. Actually the same thing, my style keep changing, and I just didn't feel like it, and I lost my motivation to finish it. Anyways the moral of this whole video is how overthinking I am, and how dramatic I'm. Angel keeps saying he is dramatic, but I swear I'm more dramatic. No one can beat me. Anyways hope you'll like the video, and if you want to, you can support me by buying merch. It's actually hard to gain money from commissions while studying. As I mentioned I end up sometimes skipping many classes, so merch is the best way to help me. You can suggest me what to sell next. Stickers? Pins? Keychains? You can suggest me ideas in the comments. Thank you so much for watching.